Come on! You gotta be kidding me! Sorry about that, mister. Sorry? You just wasted $40 worth of food. Sorry isn't gonna fix it. You know, you people are the worst. You're gonna pay me back for that wasted food. But I, I, I got no money. Ooh, who? Well, you better figure out something fast or I'm calling the cops. You know what? It's a nice pendant. I'll tell you this. You give me that, and we'll call it even. I can't. It, it, it means too much to me. I've won this every day of my life since I was 18. Blah, blah, blah. I didn't ask for your whole life story. I'll make it simple for you. Either you give it to me, or I'll call the cops and report you for vagrancy and uh, public drinking. Miss, please, have a heart. I, I just can't. It's too important. Well, when you put it like that, I understand. Have it your way. Please, mister, don't do this to me. It's the only thing I have left. Hello, police? Yeah, I'd like to report a crime. Yeah, the suspect okay, okay, still Okay, 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 okay. Thank you for your time. Here. Ooh. Well, that's nice. Hey. It looks better on me anyway, huh? <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Come on now. Don't be like that. Cheer up. Have a good day. Hey, Pop, I'm home. Hey, Pop, you did. Oh, sorry. You snuck up on me. Pop, I thought we talked about this. You can't sit around all day looking at old stuff from the war. It isn't good for you. Neither's forgetting. Yes, I, I know. Uh, Listen, Bob, ever since you adopted me, I could remember you sitting around looking at old photos and memorabilia, but you never talked about your experience over there. I, I know you went through a lot over there, but I think you should just leave the past in the past. <laughs> if only it were that easy. Every day, I have to live knowing that I survived. And so many others did. Where did you get that? Yeah, it's cool, isn't it? Where did you get it? It's just from some homeless guy down at the plaza. Homeless? Yeah. Uh, Pop, calm down. What, what's uh, wrong? I want you to take me to him. Take you where? The man you got that pendant from. Let's go! Pop, just, just... Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> he's still got a pulse. I think he's got alcohol poisoning. Call an ambulance. Oh, come on, Dan. Why is this guy so important to you? Just call an ambulance. <sighs> All right. We're going to get you some help. Just hold on a little longer. Hello, 911? Any progress? Nothing yet. Pop, you can talk to me. Who is this man to you? Someone I never thought I'd see again. It's time I tell you about my time in the war. You see, the enemy had taken our position and decimated our squad. I was shot multiple times and was bleeding out. Thankfully, a soldier from another squad a man I'd never met carried me over half a mile on his back to the field hospital. The doctors told me if I had gotten there even one minute later, I wouldn't have survived. I was being prepped for surgery and barely conscious. 
but the soldiers saw how scared I was. Right before surgery, he gave me a part of a pendant he wore as a lucky charm. He promised it would help get me through the surgery, and I promised I'd give it back to him when I was healed. He left to save more men, and I never saw him again. So you see, it wasn't just a pendant that he gave me. It was the gift of hope. And it worked. It got me through my long recovery and the rest of the war. Without him, I wouldn't be here today. And you wouldn't be here with me today. I searched for him every day since, but I never found him. I assumed he was killed in action, at least until you came home with that pendant. Can't believe it. I mean, I treated him so poorly, and I, I should have helped him. Oh, no. It's not you again. Don't call the cops on me, man. I, I gave you everything I had. I know, I know. You know, that pendant was my most prized possession. That wasn't good enough for you. I, I'm sorry. I, I, I don't know what else. Listen, sir, so I'm... You're safe now. I'm here to apologize to you. The way I treated you, I'm... I'm truly ashamed. Look, I want to give this back to you. Yes. Yes, I, I took advantage of you and... I am just truly sorry. I also have something I need to give back to you. Who are you? What in the... Is... Is it really you? I have been looking for you for almost 40 years, <laughs> and I finally found you. <laughs> and I can finally thank you for saving my life. Oh, I did what was needed. Anyone would have done the same. No, not just anyone would have done what you did. You gave me hope when I needed it most. And there is nothing I can ever say that would ever thank you enough. Oh, I don't know what to say. You don't need to say a thing. Mm -hmm. You don't have to ever worry about being hungry or being homeless ever again. When you get out of here, we want you to come stay with us. <laughs> no, 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 it's too much, it's too much, it's too much. No, no, it's nonsense. I mean, you saved my father. If you hadn't done that, then I wouldn't live the life I have today. <sighs> Please, it's the least we can do on behalf of what you've done for me and my family. So what do you say? <sighs> okay. I'll come and stay with you. <laughs> thank you so much. No, thank you, my friend. Thank you. <laughs>